Gene therapy is uh, for patients with inherited retinal degeneration. They have a defective gene which uh, doesn't produce the protein that they need and that's what leads to cells in the retina dying. What we're doing is actually replacing the gene using um, the gene embedded in a virus which is delivered to the back of the eye. Um, and then that gene is taken up, starts producing the virus, uh, the protein, and therefore you stop any further vision loss because the eye is now working properly. So we've started this for a disease called choroidomemia, which is an X-linked uh, retinal uh, rod cone dystrophy. And we're also working on people with uh, RPGR mutations now, which is another X-linked type of RP. This is going to open up a huge number of options for a, a big group of patients and particularly because these conditions affect patients at a younger age so from childhood working age there's a very long-term impact on not only that individual but also the family for inherited diseases we've never had an option to restore vision before but now a lot of new technologies are being developed in the lab to help protect from further vision loss or even in future restore vision. Initial results of the first six patients was published in The Lancet in 2014 and showed some improvements in some patients which is more than we were expecting. Then um, we had a follow-up paper for the first six patients in the New England Journal of Medicine last year which showed that those initial six patients after five years still had their improvement in vision even though the other eye was deteriorating. And we're just in the process of publishing the results of the entire first trial which is 14 patients. We're currently running phase two trials and we're starting phase three very shortly. So uh, we're hoping we should be able to submit for, for approval to get this approved as a treatment within a few years. Recently in America, the FDA have approved another gene therapy for labors um, for RP65 mutations. Um, it's been approved as, as a treatment by the FDA, so that gives us hope that we could be next. <laughs>